Hey everyone, I know it's been a while since my last post, but I'm back and let's get started again with some quick English lessons. So today's lesson is a very fast one and it's something I've noticed a lot of people have difficulty with. When you want to ask a person about the length of time that is required for that person to do something, you have to ask it in this way. How long does it take you to blah, 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 blah. For example, if you would like to know the length of time your friend needs to drive from her house to arrive to her work, your question would be, how long does it take you to drive to work? In order to answer this question, this simple way would be, it takes me to drive to work. For example, it takes me 30 minutes to drive to work. You can also ask this question for something that happened in the past or something that will happen in the future. For example, for the past, how long did it take blah, 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 blah. So how long did it take you to finish your exam? Or how long did it take your brother to finish his driving test? If you want to ask in the future, you would say, how long will it take? And you finish your sentence, or you finish your question. Now, of course, to answer the simple past, you would say, it took me, you know, one hour to finish my test or it took my brother 30 minutes to finish his driver's license test. And finally, to answer the future, you say it will take. It will take 30 minutes to complete the exam. Uh, it will take eight hours to drive from Toronto to Montreal. Well, not exactly, but just an example. Thanks for listening, and I promise there will be more to come.